We're at the uh, stadium. There's a fan festival going on. Sounds pretty booming, to be fair. So we're going to try again there. Um, there's this massive queue of fans here. I don't know what's going on. I'm not quite sure. Hopefully, I'm waiting this queue. We're into the fan festival. Absolutely booming. That free beer is all gone. So today we are in the mix zone for, um, well we've got press passes for today which is absolutely amazing. We've been stood here for a bit, some of the players have come past. We've had Mark Hughes, the gaffer, some of the players. It's yeah, quite interesting to be in here. Relegated and they count it down in the stadium. That's counting 52 years since, well, since they've been in the Bundesliga, never been relegated. Oh, what a drag! To Stoke and Hamburg for letting us in there. Uh, how has it been? Travel over and all that? Uh, travel over, fantastic there. Uh, got a bit delayed in the hotel late last night. We stopped in two hours away, but we managed to get here. Uh, fantastic. Yeah. Uh, two bus journeys, three trains to get here. But we got here and it's happy day. Yeah, loving it. Enjoying Stoke. Germany? Loving it. Absolutely loving it. I tell you what, Germany's probably one of the nicest places ever. But I tell you what, Stokies, man, we need to get here in force. Next year, when we're back in the Europa League, man, we need to get here in force. I think we're getting to the Europa League next season, then? Yeah, right. definitely. definitely. Seven, seven place, seven place finish, man. No, we'll still be on the right, man. It's, it's, it's a couple of little sparks, Anthony, man. He's done all right, he's done all right, man. I think, I think, I tell you what, good. So, half time, it's nil-nil. We've had a few chances. What are you going to go for? Score prediction, end of the game. Oh, you, 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 you. Hopefully a 1-0 win for Stoke. Yeah. Somebody's going to sneak a goal. I can't see them scoring, to be honest with you. I can't see them scoring. But you never know, do you? You never know. I'm, I, I think I think we're sneakers, sneaky one 0 win today. I think we're sneaky one 0 I'm gonna get further. Two 0 two 0 Shakiri, Boyan. There you go. There you go. There you go. Thanks, guys. Happy oh God. But Butland's back to his best. What a guy. Amazing what save. A, what a guy. Amazing save. Who could pull that off? England's number one, and England's number one all day long. Fantastic. Fantastic. That's all these guys. It's half time. We go watch the rest of the game. Callum after the game today, lost 1-0, uh, wasn't the greatest of performances, thoughts? 
Well, basically, I thought we were really bad. We only had two shots on target, about two shots on target. I think we need to get, if we get a striker in, we'll be all right. Pretty much, yeah. Barahina? Yeah, Barahina. You've yeah. still got your heart set on Barahina well, with well, everything that's going on at the maybe, minute. Maybe Bo Boney on loan. Re yeah, Bo Boney or Remy on loan. Yeah, season-long loan, view to permanent deal. Do you think that the starting lineup for Borough is going to be pretty much the same what there was today, or do you think there'll be changes? Yeah. I'm not sure. Like Charlie Adams has been playing in pre-season, so maybe he might feature in the team. But apart from that, he'll probably be in there. So I'm going to ask you for your score prediction for next weekend. Oh, two-one, two-one Stoke. A win. Two Start yeah. the season with a win. Yeah. Scores. Uh, Shakiri and Ju. Got some money on it, just in case. Yeah. Thanks very much, Callum. That's Amberg, absolutely great, brilliant way to round it off. Uh, brilliant trip, brilliant atmosphere, and beers.